Welcome back to another Canadian episode of Omnicraft Vanilla. And you're probably wondering, did I change my skin? Well, no, I did not. Uh, if you go into customization, you could take this all off, and you can also put it back on. So earlier today, I made a I made a second layer of the skin since 1.8 you can make new layers. So that's what I did. Uh, before we do anything today, um, I'm going to copy some of these banners and edit the episode. See you guys next time. Nope, I'm joking. That's not what we're here today for. Um, great, logic's here. What does he want? Uh, so, last episode, we left off with all this kind of stuff everywhere. Um, this side was not dug down, it was just all flat. Um, so we're gonna hop down here, and I'm gonna show you what I've been doing over the wilds and over the legs and crashes and stuff. Is that what it is? Those are stairs? Man. Okay, whatever. I'm not I'm not concerned about that. So right now I'm smelting up some of that and it looks like it's all done. So that's all done. Got all our rails there. We got some nether brick from uh logic. And uh yeah. So this is our station. This is the station that's gonna go this way to spawn and the other one's gonna be receiving the station to receive passengers so yeah and uh... just so people know this our, this is our station where i'm gonna be adding flags these flags on the posts so people know it's the Canadian stop and yeah so all you haters don't be hating so all I need to do for the station is just do the roof and do the tracks and uh yeah for this station and then I gotta dig all the way to spawn uh we're gonna head over to spawn in just a second and I'm gonna show you guys what I've been doing there and how it's going along uh yeah Okay, so we're just gonna go back up here and then I'm gonna get some chests. Oops, sorry about that. Have to fix my mic. Uh, before we go to spawn, I'm just gonna place down some glowstone behind there. I have a couple uh, glowstone left. Uh, oh, also, I got a new enchantment Fire Aspect 1 and Sharpness 2 on a book. So that's that's nice. And I also got Silk Touch. I think I, I think you guys know about that one. Not sure. So we're and glowstone behind that escalators. Of course, it's the escalators that don't work. Oh man. Okay. Have to use soap touch on that. Boom, boom, and boom. All right. Let's get soap touch quick, and then head off to spawn show you guys a little bit of what spawns looking like uh... silk touch is softy silk is right here uh... still getting that little lag spike kind of thing why you know nts oh. So what else is saying? We got the cows, we got all of that. All you guys know about that stuff. Um, also found another spawner, that's why I have like name tags and a couple more saddles and all that. Um, so yeah. Uh, so we got an easy way to spawn we just type spawn in the chat that's why you see people put type in spawn and dash boots dash boots is like a new command not a new command it's just when you type it you get like some kind of effects 
dash boots. So you get some speed and you get hunger. So it takes away your hunger and it gives you speed. So it's cool. It's coolie cools. It's kind of useful. Uh, so yeah, that's what the station's looking like. Pretty nice. Let's go to spawn and let's check out what spawn's actually looking like after the first episode. So over here is going to be the staff offices. That's the new station, traders, XP traders, mailbox thing. I'm not sure it's going to be over there. Probably some monuments. And another portal. Diamond is also working on spawn, so she's the spawn master, I guess you could say. That house is looking fancy. That's all I have to say. The house is looking fancy. Alright, so. This is where I'm going to be putting another station. And of course I put the donation box. So if you play on the server, please donate. Um, this will be the eastbound and this is going to be the westbound. So to get to my town, you're going to need to take the westbound. And then it's going to go to another station I'm going to be making somewhere else. Or probably I'll, ma I'll make a just junction that just goes straight off to my town. And then, yeah. So that's that's cool. It's going to go straight to my town. And, yeah. And so I don't know what to say now. I'm scared. No. Okay. Uh, let's walk around and let's see what's... Ooh, whoa! That. That is a cool looking replica. Nope. I gotta go back down. I wonder who built that. That is sick. That looks nice. Let's see who made it. Uh, Jet Pancake and Durst Prismarine Shop. Closed for now. Wow. 16 Dark Prismarine equals 2 diamonds. 10 Prismarine Shards. Payment Chest. Okay. Prismarine Brick. Nice. Prismarine. What is Prismarine? Sponge. Whoa. Three diamonds, sea lantern. That's nice. It's really nice. It's a nice shop. I think that's the best addition to the town so far. Uh, who's that up there? That is f the guy with a lot of numbers. <laughs> and he has a fancy house going. Let's check out what he's doing up here. Sleep on the third floor. So he has a lookout area. And he has sky things. Another lookout area. Nice view of spawn. Really nice. And I like this idea too. Nice. Thought this so this is the bedroom. What's this third floor? Okay. Alright, so I guess that is uh this is spawn. Um when we come back I'm gonna be working on my the station. Actually I'm gonna gather some materials for this station and uh we'll be back. Well first let me see what this is. This is kinda eye appealing. I wanna see what this is. Looks like it's probably a house. Alright, so I'm gonna go back to the house, get some materials for here, and uh, I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so I'm getting really lucky here. Just now, I just made up a new pick because I was, instead of using all my iron, I was just gonna say, whatever, let's make a diamond pick. So I, I made a diamond pick, popped it in, got silk touch. Okay. So, uh, I'm gonna keep this one in a chest, back somewhere else, I don't know. Maybe I should take it on the adventure as I dig it out, so I can get, you know, that stuff. And now, I pop in my other diamond pick that I was 
gonna enchant a long time ago. And uh, look what I got. Fortune 1. And uh, I'm not turning down that offer. What is this? I'm breaking, I'm breaking. I'm not turning that offer down. That is the best enchants I just got. I'm extremely happily. Ha happily. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna have to make another diamond pick. It's no biggie. Because I have my diamonds. And I am stacking. Please give me efficiency, something better. Thank you. What is this? Efficiency 1, I'm breaking. I don't have 20 levels. Uh, let's see, how am I gonna get 20 levels? 20 levels. I need to kill some mobs. Uh, okay. So I'm just gonna kill these mobs and, uh, get the 20 levels, and, uh, I'll meet you back at spawn. Alrighty, guys, I'm back. We're at spawn. Uh, shouldn't have came downstairs. Um, let's put a torch. Where are my torches? That's right, I just lost my torches when I, um, when the server re rebooted. So, so far we got the east side, or we're working on the westbound, uh, rail. I got the this side done gotta set up uh, the escalator whatever it's called I call it escalators and stairs cause in subway stations they have the escalators on one side for the lazy people and then staircases on the other side I have a bad s I have a bad sign three planks and I called it no the glass vein hmm Oh great, here comes the zombie apocalypse. Ah. Ah. Ooh, iron sword, what is it on it? There's nothing on it. Okay. So I'm gonna go down here. Um I have silk touch on the silk touch pick on me. So I'm gonna be using that to get some of the stone instead of going to smelt it. Cause that's just time consuming when you could just soak touch it and um get it like that so it will be easier for me to get the stone bricks and uh stone slabs uh easier for me to just do my stuff and then I got the efficiency pick on me on the other side that I'm using uh what level is this fifty three Let's go 54, or let's go to 50. Level 50 sounds good. Let's place down that. Let's go down. Use the silk touch. So, in the comments below, tell me what you guys think of, uh, the designs that I should use for spawns, um, spawn subway, like the building design. What I, what kind of blocks should I use? Quartz? Should I use nether brick? Should I use what I'm using for the station? Just tell me what I need to use, cause I want to go more. I don't know. I want it to look nice so others, like new members, can enjoy it and see the cool look of it cuz I don't like to have my stuff looking all plain and stuff and yeah uh... okay so I'm gonna dig this out to level 50 for this part can't remember what it was for the other one might have to go back to um the house and check. 
So once we get back, uh, I'm gonna show you guys the progress that I've done. Capture on camera so no one comes to grief. Whatever is griefed is uh, recorded. So yeah. So I'll meet you guys in a second. All right, guys. So we're back, and I dug down to level 45, which is uh, the tunnel level that I started mines on. And I don't want to go lower. I don't want to go higher. This is the level that I want the platforms to be where people stand on, and then uh, level 44 is where the tracks are. So all for that. This is what I've got and done so far. It's gonna clear out some more off camera and then tomorrow, possibly tomorrow, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be busy or not. I'm gonna hop on, clear it out, and uh hopefully get some other people to help me out. Clear this uh tunnel out. So it's easier for me to place the blocks and everything, get it finished, and maybe make it make sure it doesn't take as long as it did for my tunnel. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This has got twenty one blocks. So that's eight. Mm -mm -mm. Just gonna keep digging. Just so if anyone wants to keep digging, uh they know where to go. And also there's a cave here, so that's another thing. We could get our end of sight and all that. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. There we go. So that's how far we're going to go. Um, that's how far the eastbound station platform is. Just going to clear all of this off out on the uh, off camera. Place down the remaining slabs that I have. And, uh, yeah. So I guess that's about it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. And next episode, we will probably start on the building for the, the town train station. Or spawns train station. Because we don't want it to stay as cobble for a while. Uh, we want it to look nice. We want people to look at it like they see that guardian. That look, the Guardian looks really nice. I like it. So yeah, that's about it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, what's it called? Yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next one. And, uh, yeah. So does uh, this guy. See this guy right here? The Thug Gun Expo Mountie. <laughs> Alright, guys. I'm going to let you go now. Bye-bye. <laughs>